Hello, this is Hawk Naveen, and today we are going to be reading Level 101, also known as Your Dreams Shall Not... Oh, I forgot the title. Oh, that's embarrassing. If you like this video, please leave a like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. Let's get right into this. That's going to be a funny story. I stood there with my eyes on the horizon, coat and scarf blown about by the wind, standing on the beach. How was it so quiet? The wind and the sea rushed and howled, but it was so serene. It was so beautiful. Survival difficulty, class two, unsafe, secure, high entity count. I hear footsteps from behind, tiny feet crunching into the, crunching on the sand and the shells of the ground beneath. I turn and there she is, my daughter, my little girl. She seemed entranced by the movement of the waves. Her eyes glazed over as her attention became fixated on the water. She is precious, precious to me. Level 101 is the 102nd level of the back groups. Level 101 is a night perfect replica of Earth, the third planet from the Sun and the origin of most wanderers within the back rooms. While level 101 resembles Earth in almost every way, it is unknown how well it replicates other areas beyond Earth, if it does at all. If it does not, it was not made apparent, according to reports from those who have been to level 101. Visions of a time without her flash into my mind. Visions of hounds and fires and faceless things that I have to force myself to forget again. Those memories aren't real. Not anymore. Once you enter level 101, you awaken within your home before entering the back rooms. No records exist of what occurs to homeless individuals or those who were born within the back rooms when they enter level 101. Either due to none having entered level 101 as of yet, or due to those individuals having not exited level 101. While there are several beliefs on what exactly occurs, the prevailing theory is that once you enter level 101, you are effectively reinserted in into your life prior to enter the back rooms. Although how this conflicts with the possibility of multiple waters ex existing within the level is not known or reported. I see my daughter picking up a shell with her tiny hands. She's real. I rush over and pick up my flesh and blood, scooping her into my arms and clutching her close to my chest as I press my head against hers, and her confused face turns to a happy one as her eyes close and she coos softly. However, level 101 has several recorded inconsistencies, which gradually become more visible and more intense as time passes within level 101. You two having fun? The inconsistencies are poorly understood, but certain elements and repeated cross legitimate reports, several of which are recorded below. Tendency to perceive lampposts as too tall although by how much varies. Almond water does not exist. While it is assumed it's impossible to create almond water, the product is not sold or distributed by any vendor, nor is it recognized by any search engine. This does not appear to have a major effect, if any, on the earth of level 101. Periods where sound does not align with the forces causing it, described as lagging behind. Since level 1 is still within the hypothetical boundaries of the backrooms, certain from not, are not typical to other levels of the backrooms can still occur, but this is less substantial in reports. Certain animals, deers, stoats, several varieties of fish, most snakes, dogs that are within or related to the boys that a breed, and humans lack or have an excess of skin when viewed from a distance. Suppose 
was only approximately a hundred in meters. Uh, this is an estimate based on reports. This effect appears to be a hallucination as only observed by wanderers, as it usually does not last more for more than a moment. New Zealand does not appear on any world maps. New Zealand still exists and still has an effect act on the world of Love 101, but maps do not and reportedly cannot feature New Zealand in any capacity. This is not noticed by the native inhabitants of Love 101. I turned to face him standing there up on the dune, hair pushed back by the wind and sand covering his legs. Judging by his face, he's obviously cold in his shorts and shirt, but he's trying to hide it in his weirdly adorable way. For a moment, his skin is wrong, baggy, haggard, like layers of flesh were draped over him, but face was like Link. I feel for my medication in my pocket. Basis, outposts, and communities. Given that access to level 101 is based entirely on random chance and is incredibly difficult to access, as of writing, there are no lasting efforts by any faction to establish an outpost in level 101. I shrug and set our other down. Maybe we were just waiting for you. He laughs. You're too kind. He walks to my side and watches as our daughter runs along the shore, waddling in her big coat. Oh. Hmm. Entrances and exits. Entrances. Level 101 is entirely inaccessible except for unlocked doors found in level 2. The chances of a door allowing for access to level 101 is unknown given that there are only seven recorded instances of individuals accessing Love 101, of which only three have been and confirmed and verified. Makes sense, you're basically leaving the back rooms. Would be really difficult. Can't believe she's almost a year old. I nod. Oh yes. I remember. I was there when she was born. Did you know that? He laughs again, this time more forced. He's heard this joke okay before, but he laughs anyway. I saw, I saw. Exits. Our daughter returns back. Oh, sorry. Our daughter turns back to us, presenting a large shell she found. It was smooth, purple, white. It was beautiful. I take it. I fill it with my, my thumbs. It's amazing, sweetie. And to my husband, who holds it up to his eye and inspects it as if he were an appraiser examining a gem. Fantastic contour, but the luster is hardly exceptional. I chuckle and give him a shove. Hey, I'm Greg at work. I roll my eyes and turn back to the the horizon. Stating, I'm ready to go back, invariably causes you to fall unconscious and reawaken in level zero, usually with some degree of disorientation. There it is again, that creeping feeling. Sound of the waves doesn't match your motions. The sun is just a little oh, too far to the left. The clouds don't move a fraction too quickly. The feeling fades in moments as my husband takes my hand in his. Anyway, that was level 101 of the back rooms. If you like this video, please like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. I have no idea what I'm going to be doing tomorrow, so until then, goodbye!